Hello folks, welcome to Sherwood Park Toledo located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Today I'm going to be showing you this 2019 Toyota Avalon XSE. Now the most notable features on this XSE is its heated front seats, you'll also have your blind spot monitoring and your wireless charging. Now I'm going to go through a couple more features on the inside and outside of the vehicle just to get you a bit familiar with this 2019 Toyota Avalon XSE. Let's get started. Now a couple of the exterior features that you will see on this XSE is its daytime running lights and then if we take a look just over on the side here you're going to see your 19 inch aluminum alloy wheels. Now taking a look on your mirrors you have your integrated signal lamps as well as your foldable mirrors, heated mirrors and then if we take a look on the inside of the mirror here you're going to see your blind spot monitoring indicator. Now with your blind spot monitoring indicator it will actually light up just alerting you that there is another vehicle right beside you. The other great thing is you do have the smart key system with it, so with the smart key system you can lock all the doors simultaneously just by pushing on the two little lines you see there on the handle. Push it on once, it'll lock all the doors automatically, and then if you put your hand between the handle, it'll unlock the front door for you as well. Now this is all possible just as long as you do keep the key fob on you at all times, and the color we're going to be taking a look at today is black. Now to start off with, we're going to be taking a look at your front dash as well as your front seats, just so you have a much better idea of how much space there is. Now you have your black leather and cloth combination seat surfaces as well as your power driver seat with lumbar support. And taking a look just over on your left hand side, you're going to see your trip info and then you also have your automatic headlights, traction control on and off, trunk release and gas cap release. On the inside of your driver's side door you have your mirror controls, window locks, power locks, window controls both your front and rear windows. Now a couple of the controls you'll see here on the steering wheel include your scroll function, back, Bluetooth, volume control, voice recognition, as well as your um, lane departure alert, cruise control, mode select, and seek function. Now the other nice thing is you do have the paddle shifters on here as well. And if we take a look here, you have that push button start, so all you have to do is put your foot on the brake, hit the push button, and it will start up for you automatically. Now taking a look at the display here, you have a couple of different options on here, so taking a look at the very top here, you're going to see your digital speedometer as well as your fuel economy with a distance to empty. And then taking a look down farther, you're going to see your driving support for your lane departure alert, audio control, and then you have your pre-collision system with your blind spot monitoring and your rear cross traffic alert. And then if you scroll over again, you're going to see your tire pressure monitoring, your settings menu with your lane departure alert, pre-collision system, blind spot monitoring on and off, along with your rear cross traffic alert, and a couple of other additional features. Now at the very bottom of the screen there you're going to see an exterior temperature gauge and taking a look at the center dash as well as the touch panel display you're going to see a couple of different options on here so as you can see you have that nice large screen on there and then if we take a look you have your home screen here along with your digital clock and then in the menu here you'll find your audio phone apps as well as a couple of other additional features. Now when you go into the apps menu this is all part of the Entune app suite. So the nice thing with the Entune app suite is as long as you have it on your phone, you can use such apps as the Scout GPS app, which allows you to stream your maps from your phone onto the touch panel display, making things much easier when you're trying to find something. Or you can also check local fuel prices as well. Now, if we take a look just underneath here, you are going to see your hazard lights. You have your heated seat controls for your driver and passenger with three different settings depending on how hot you would like it. Dual zone climb control settings. And if we look underneath, you have this nice pad area and then underneath that, you'll also find the wireless charging. So the on button's just located in the back there. So once you turn it on, you can just place your phone on top and have it start charging for you. Now it's matted to a automatic transmission along with your eco, normal and sport mode. And taking a look up top you have your auto dimming rear view mirror with your integrated garage door opener. And a couple of the controls you'll see up top here include your SOS safety connect. So in the event that you are in a front end collision and you are unable to respond, emergency services will be sent out to you promptly. Now you do have your open and closed and tilt up and down feature for your power moonroof. So if you want to have a bit of a breeze flowing through the vehicle you can. And then just to give you a quick idea of what your backup camera is going to look like, as you can see you have those nice guiding lines on there and you can also change the view of the backup camera as well to a more dynamic view or to the traditional backup camera view you're, uh, you're used to. 
Finally, we'll be taking a look at your rear cargo area as well as your trunk. Now looking on the back of your trunk, you're gonna see your rear spoiler. And then just underneath your black Avalon emblem, you'll find your backup camera and your rear hatch release will be located just over on your right hand side. So I'm just gonna close in on the rear cargo space just so you have a much better idea of how much room there is. If you do require some additional space, you can actually fold down that 60-40 split rear seat just by pulling on one of the two tabs that you see up top. Now the other nice thing is you have the cargo liner in the back here, so in the event that you have any liquids placed back here, you can just uh, clean it up much easier with this cargo liner. Not only that, you can have it removed afterwards and cleaned up properly. Now if we take a look just underneath the floor here, you'll find your jack tool kit and one more under you'll find the spare tire. So if you do find yourself in a bit of a pinch, you know exactly where it's located. Thank you so much folks for watching this video today. If you have any questions, please visit us. We're located at 31 Audemars Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. The phone number is 780-410-2455 or please visit our website at sptoyota.com to get us by email. Once again, folks, thank you so much for watching this video today. If you have any comments or any additional questions, please leave them in the comment section located down below. Other than that, make sure you have a great day, and I hope to see you next time.